Juliana? Yes? Come here, baby. Hi. Come lay down next to me. Let me tell you a story about what parents do for the love of a child. She from Cuba and he from Spain. Leza and David met in Las Vegas. They fell in love and were married. She, a professional musical dancer who came to be in Las Vegas with the former Havana Nights show, and he, arriving from Spain, contracted as an acrobat with La Rev. Both talented, filled with strength and spiritual emotion, expressed through their almost perfect bodies. I say almost perfect because their primary goal was to have a family. Suddenly, they found themselves with no jobs, no health insurance, and completely lost in their new Las Vegas home. However, the passion to have a family did not extinguish. Their love and faith filled them with strength. After two years of attempting to become pregnant and filled with desperation, they decided to travel to Spain to consult with a fertility specialist. Upon examination, the Spanish doctor found ovarian cysts and this appeared to be the reason for her infertility. They returned to the U.S. to have her cysts surgically removed. However, they found more. Laza's fallopian tubes were damaged and it was for this reason that she was unable to bear life from within. They began the painful IVF injections and the magical day arrived. The IVF was successful and they were ecstatic at being pregnant. Two embryos were planted and now flourishing. The days went by. Laza and David were filled with joy. They were not walking, they were floating. Their plans grew. They were searching for two new baby names. Dark clouds were on the horizon. At their nine-week ultrasound, they received the news that the embryo's heartbeats had been silenced. Inside Laza, there was no life. With outward physical attributes touched by angels, now began to feel anxiety and sadness permeating their hearts. For them, the soul of the world took its last breath. Tears fell without control. Holding each other in their arms, they melted into submission. They stopped believing. Questioning began. Drowning in silent screams, this was the saddest day of their life. Nothing had meaning, and in that instance, there was no room for hope. Days went by and a sky that began to shine between the clouds. Life for them continued. The ocean waves could be faintly heard in the distance once again, and the birds returned to flight. Laza and David are examples of true love, the love that is described in the most critically acclaimed poems, a biblical love. Today they continue to struggle. The realization of the family dream is the impulse that keeps them alive. God is with them. They have not given up hope and never will. Their love makes them one. This is the main and extraordinary force that God has provided as his legacy. They are aware of this and this is why they awake every morning with a smile and a security that soon they will have in their hands what they have so strongly desired.